Day one, we're looking for Binky's house. No clue where it is. We're here in Leisure World. I'm very lost right now. So, starting off lost. Hopefully, we get found. All right, I think we found it. Get ready for some dog training. Yeah, I'm filling out an application. They uh, they saw my bald head and they said, "Are you applying this morning?" I said, "No, I'm here to train somebody's dog." Thanks, though. Blue collar Jew coming here to work. <laughs> All right, I uh, I just got here. Over and out. Just good morning. Just don't mess up my web. Good morning. Hello. How's it going? Alright, how are you? Great. Dylan. David. Nice to meet you. Nice. Hey. This is Haley. Hello. She's going to be in training with us. And this is Binky. Is this Binky? Yeah. Hey, Binky. You got a whole little play area. My God, are you cute? Look at that face. But she's like, as you can see, she's really, really skittish. I oh, yeah, she's gonna run away. Well, so it's part. They're uh, they're a herding dog, so right. they are reacting to me, and because I'm not a cow or a lamb or something, where they're like, all right, I can see the motion. They're like, I gotta, I gotta kind of herd and protect. And... Yeah, it's just in the nature. I can't get her to do her business outside. I walk her, but still. The thing is, is she does her business inside. It's really difficult to move her out for any length of time because what she does is she jumps on me and she starts biting all the time instead. Let's do this. See if you can put her in there and I'm going to get her. We call you a hot mess. Look at you. Oh. It's just the initial start that she's yeah. so scared. So let's see what we got here. Hurting, high energy, fight or flight, and it's this like anxiety prone fight or flight. It's not a I'm confident so I'm gonna bark at you. The dog's barking out of its own nervousness. Yeah, it's, it's like a... <laughs> She does the weirdest things. I don't understand the reason behind some of it. It's like water running. It bothers her with water running. When I brush my hair, it bothers her too. This 
tool is a directional tool. Right? So the whole point of this, even though your dog wants to chew on it, is to show the dog the direction. It also is your first line of communication to your dog. Remember those old phones where it was the, um, the two plastic cups with the string? Right. Your dog's a plastic cup and I'm a plastic cup and this is the string. You pull too hard, you're going to pull the cup off. Right? right? I don't want the dog to feel that pop as if I'm trying to pull the cup out of its hand. This is just supposed to show a straight line for where I want it to go. Good job. All right, you guys can come back in. And if you guys want, come give Binky some love. Ooh. 